certain things that's mandatory that you should pay for in a relationship with a woman, okay? For example, her rent. Bro, what are you talking about, man? That's number one. No woman should be paying her own rent if she's in a relationship with a man, all right? Her car payment, her light bill, her groceries, absolutely, she should never pay for groceries. Say, hold up, wait a minute, something ain't right. Issue with this is we live in a world where women feel as though you can get something for nothing and it's okay. I want you to pay very close attention to everything this woman is saying, but notice what she is not saying. What does the man get? We'll discuss right after this. <laughs> What's going on everybody? Welcome to another video. Don't forget to hit that like button on your way in. Click on that notification bell that will let you know every time I upload content. And you know what we're going to do. We're going to roll that clip. Certain things that's mandatory that you should pay for in a relationship with a woman. Okay. For example, her rent. That's number one. No woman should be paying her own rent if she's in a relationship with a man, all right? Her car payment, her light bill, her groceries, absolutely, she should never pay for groceries. Her gas, her insurance, because, I mean, if you're paying her car payment, you might as well pay the insurance as well. Don't you care about her safety? Yeah, pay the insurance. Shopping. Okay, your woman should never have to spend her own money to shop. I mean, what is the point of her having sex with you? For her good health? No, take her shopping. Diamonds, okay? Diamonds are a girl's best friend. So if you're in a relationship with a woman, it is mandatory that by the six month mark, you buy her some diamonds, okay? And if your girl wants surgery, Pay for it. Why not? Guess who's going to enjoy it? You. So, yes, get her a new pair of jugs because you can play with them, all right? It's not for her benefit. It's for your benefit. Pay for her titties. You see, this is the entitlement and the greed that modern women have in the dating market. And if you look at what she was saying, look at how entitled this woman is and her looks are very, very mean. They're all mean. They're all fake. They all have weave. They all have eyelashes. They all have eagle claws. They all have the same look. And it's like the uglier the woman is, the more entitled she is. Like you have fives, fours, and threes acting as if they're nines and tens and this woman really thinks that a man is gonna do all of this for her and all she is gonna do is just sit around and that's it yep do you really honestly think any man would go for that no nope. you know a man who would go for that you know what y'all i have the perfect man for this woman the crypto super sim. This man is what this woman needs. See what the entitled woman, if you study the entitled woman, if you sit down and you actually study a woman that is entitled, it's not going to be the blue collar worker. It's not going to be the white collar worker. It's not going to be the millionaire man. It's not going to be the high value man. It's not going to be the hard working man. You know what an internal woman needs is a simp. She needs a simp that will simp for her, buy her everything, don't care about what or how she treats him. And as long as the money is coming, she doesn't have to do anything. Case in point, the OnlyFans model, Ruby Rose. What is, what is this woman done 
for him. Nothing. These women are looking for simps. That's what these women want. These women want a simp. But the issue is, is that you're expecting a blue collar, a white collar, a high value, a millionaire to be on the level of a simp. No, ladies, just go find you a simp. Go find you a guy who's sexually repressed, who's lucky to have you talking to him, who will do nothing. But who will do nothing but give you money? And there you go. Problem solved. You get what you want and he gets what he wants. The opportunity to give you money. And see, if you think about it that way, it works out. Because the woman can have all of these outrageous expectations. But the simp, the simp is going to meet them. Not only that. The simp is going to make sure that she is well taken care of financially. He'll pay for her groceries. He'll pay for her car. He'll pay for her brakes. He'll pay for everything. And all he wants in return is some sort of acknowledgement. If you think about it like that, it's a win-win for both. But eventually... The simp is going to get tired of simping, and he is going to want an ROI. For those of you who don't know what an ROI is, it's a return on investment. See, the simp looks at a woman as an investment. He's investing his time, his money, his energy, his resources, his never-ending abundance of money. And eventually, he's going to want payback. Whether it's sex, whether it's relationship, whether it's acknowledgement, whether it's affection, a relationship, love, they're going to want, they're going to want a return on investment. And that's where these women that want these simps or want these men to do whatever they want them to do, that's where they get in trouble. Instead of saying, you know what? I'm going to lower my expectations and stop being so entitled. Instead, they think that they're going to get what they want just because they say and tell the world, hey, this is what I want. But that never works out now, does it? So my advice to you, if you're a woman and you have high expectations and you're not getting them and you won't accept Cheesecake Factory, you won't accept Olive Garden, it's time to lower your expectations. Be humble. Humble yourself. Maybe that's the reason Maybe that's the reason why you're so single. You won't humble yourself. You let all these good guys pass you by for the pookie and the rain rain who leave you as soon as things get tough. You give your good and best years to the pookie and then you want the good guy to take you when The good part of you is already gone and it's not working out now, is it? Think about that the next time you want to be entitled. Anyway, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Tickle that notification bell that will let you know every time I upload new content. And until the next video, peace.